Okay, we're at the grocery store and I have spare ribs here. And you'll see there's a difference in these spare ribs. First of all, you'll notice a difference in color between this one and this one. It's the same thing, except this one here is frozen and that's why it's lighter in color. This one here that's darker in color has thawed out and that's why it has the juices. See, you'll see the dark colors here. That's a good sign. That's the color you want, like a nice red wine. Uh, you also want to make sure it's not open. And then this one here, as you can see, it's been trimmed St. Louis style. And we'll talk about that later. Another thing to point out is see this end cap here? This one's not too bad. Look at this one. It goes all the way across, all the way over to here. And so I would not want this rack for that reason because that goes to waste. So this one's better. Another thing you look for is shiners, which are bones that are showing. None of them are showing here, which is great. And one other thing I want to show you is these are all spare ribs. Over here, these are baby back ribs, and you'll see they're smaller, and they're always uniform. We'll make ours uniform, just like St. Louis, but we'll have a couple ways of doing it. But this gives you a good idea. One other thing to look at is if the bones are straight. And not a big deal, but if the bones are straight, it's easier to cut and they look nicer when they're done. Competition, it's a huge thing. And that's it. The cover. This is a good one. I found it here. See how this is open here? I don't know if you can see that. But when you can see that, someone hit it with a knife and it's lost its seal. It's probably good now, but it's only got a shelf life of about a day or so. Just wanted to point that out. Now that I got home, I realized I forgot to talk about the most important thing, and that is marbling within the ribs. Now, you'll have fat, this external fat, but what you want is the styrations, the marbling. The same thing like for a steak. You want this here. This is what you look for. You'll see it up in this part of the rib too, but this is the part we're cooking, so this is where you want to find the marbling. So, big key when looking for ribs.